Hello everyone, this is Mazhar Ali and I welcome you to my YouTube channel Learning Digitally, the YouTube channel where we explore the latest research and startup trends in natural language processing, commonly called NLP, and the latest technologies being developed. Today we will be discussing nine fascinating topics in NLP research and startups, including virtual assistants, sentiment analysis, multilingual language models, named entity recognition, language transformers, transfer learning, text summarization, semantic search, and reinforcement learning. As digital technologies are advancing rapidly, NLP is playing an increasingly critical role in transforming the way we interact with machines and with each other. The topics we will cover today are at the forefront of NLP research and have enormous potential to improve our daily lives. We encourage you to subscribe to our channel Learning Digitally if you haven't already and to press the bell icon so that you don't miss any of our upcoming videos on research and technology development. Without further ado, Let's dive into the world of NLP and explore these exciting topics. Dear viewers, NLP is a branch of artificial intelligence that is gaining significance due to the surge in unstructured language data. With the rise of social media and digital content, analyzing vast amount of user data to generate insights has become challenging. Moreover, chatbots and interactive automation systems are unable to replace human assistants due to the inability to understand semantics and context. To address these challenges, natural language models are leveraging advanced machine learning techniques to better comprehend unstructured voice and text data. So in this video, we will explore the nine NLP research trends and startups that are transforming the industry. If you are interested in conducting the research in the field of NLP and want to make your own startups, then this video may be beneficial for you. Because this video is going to open new research doors in the field of NLP for you that will enable you to make your own startups. Friends, the number one research trend and startup is a virtual assistant. There is a growing interest in virtual assistants in devices and applications as they improve accessibility and provide information on demand. However, they deliver accurate information only if the virtual assistant understands the query without misinterpretation. That is why startups are leveraging NLP to develop novel virtual assistants and chatbots. They mitigate processing errors and work continuously, unlike human virtual assistants. Additionally, NLP-powered virtual assistants find applications in providing information to factory workers, assisting academic research, and more. The virtual assistants startups are utilizing NLP to create novel virtual assistants and chatbots that mitigate processing errors and work continuously unlike human virtual assistants. I am going to share you an example of a virtual assistant startup that is ROI. Now, this startup provides AI-powered virtual assistants for customer services, HR, and IT support. Another uh, virtual assistant startup is uh, Conversica. Now, this company offers a virtual assistant that can engage in personalized conversation with the customers and uh, the prospects. Friends, number two uh, research trend is a sentiment analysis. Our increasingly digital world generates exponential amounts of data as audio, video, and text. While NLPs are able to analyze large sources of data. They are unable to differentiate between positive, negative, or neutral speech. Moreover, when support agents interact with customers, they are able to adopt their conversation based on the customer's emotional state, which typically NLP models neglect. 
Therefore, startups are creating NLP models that understand the emotional and sentimental aspects of text data along with its context. Such NLP models improve customer loyalty and retention by delivering uh, better services and customer experiences as well. So sentiment analysis startups are developing NLP models that understand the emotional or sentimental aspect of text data along with uh, its context. These models improve customer loyalty and retention by uh, delivering better services and customer experiences. For example, Effectiva. Now this is startup provides emotion recognition software for analyzing facial expressions and uh, vocal uh, intonation. Another uh, startup is at Textio. Now this company uses NLP to improve the language and tone of uh, uh, job postings, increasing the likelihood of attaining diverse uh, candidates. Friends, number three research trend is a multilingual language model. Communication is a high complex with over 7,000 languages spoken across the world, each with its own details and workings. Most current natural language processors focus on the English language and therefore either do not cater to the other markets or are inefficient. The availability of large training data sets in different languages enable the development of NLP models that accurately understand unstructured data in different languages. This improves data accessibility and allows businesses to speed up their translations, workflows, and increase their brand reach. Multilingual language models startups are developing NLP models that provide translation services. For example, on Babel, this startup provides AI-powered translation services, enabling businesses to communicate with customers and partners across different languages. DPAL, now this company offers machine translation services for a wide range of languages providing high quality translations with minimal errors. The number four research trend in the field of NLP is the named entity recognition commonly called NER. So named entity recognition is a language processor that removes these limitations by scanning unstructured data to locate and classify various parameters. Besides identifying person names, organizations, brands, etc., NER or named entity recognition classifies dates and times, email addresses and numerical instruments like money and weight. NER models thus facilitate data extraction workflows across industries. There are lots of startups and research problems available. However, I present here two examples of them. Rosette. This startup provides NLP software for entity extraction, enabling businesses to classify and categorize data from unstructured test sources. Alien. This company offers NLP solutions for new analysis including entity recognition, sentiment analysis, and summarization. Friends, number five research trend is a language transformers. Language transformers are neural network architectures that apply self-attention mechanisms to better understand the relationships between sequential elements, avoiding issues like similar sounding words. So, natural language solutions require massive language data sets to train processors. This training processors deals with issues like similar sounding words that affect the performance of NLP models. Language transformers avoid these by applying self-attention mechanisms to better understand the relationships between sequential elements Moreover, this type of neural network architecture ensures that the weighted average calculation for each word is unique. Examples of startups are Hugging Face. Now, this startup provides open source NLP software including pre-trained transformers models like BERT and GPT-3. Eleuther AI, this company is building an open source language model called GPT-New 
which aims to be more accessible and decentralized than existing models. Number six research trend is a transfer learning. Transfer learning enables NLP models to share much of their training data, significantly reducing the time and cost to train new models. Friends, machine learning tasks are domain specific and models are unable to generalize their learning. So this causes problems as a real world problem is a mostly unstructured unlike training data sets. Consequently, this affects the predictability of the trained models. However, many language models are able to share much of their training data using transfer learning to optimize the general process of deep learning. So the application of transfer learning in natural language processing significantly reduces the time and cost to train new NLP models. For example, OpenAI. This research organization is known for its work on transfer learning in NLP, including the GPT series of language models. Another example is A121 Waves. This startup offers a language model called Jurassic One that uses transfer learning to generate human-like text. So friends, you may make your own startup based on your research for different organizations and industries. Number seven research trend in the field of NLP is the taste summarization. Natural language processors are extremely efficient at analyzing large data sets to understand human language as it is spoken and written. However, typical NLP models lack the ability to differentiate between useful and useless information when analyzing large text documents. Therefore, Startups are applying machine learning algorithms to develop NLP models that summarize lengthy texts into a cohesive and fluent summary that contains all key points. The main benefits of such language processors are the time savings in deconstructing a document and the increase in productivity from quick data summarization. Viewers, Test summarization startups are applying machine learning algorithms to develop NLP models that summarize lengthy text into a cohesive and fluent summary that contains all key points. For example, summarize bot. Now, this startup provides a chat bot that can summarize articles, emails, and other text sources in real time. Another example is OpenAI GPT-3. This language model can generate summaries of long text passages as well as write entire articles from a given prompt. Number eight research trend is a semantic search. Search engines are an integral part of workflows to find and receive digital information. One of the barriers to effective searches is the lack of understanding of the context and intent of the input data. So NLP enables semantic search queries that analyze search intent. This improves search accuracy and provides more relevant results. Hence, semantic search models find applications in areas such as e-commerce, academic research, enterprise knowledge management, and in more more fields. Examples of semantic search startups and research trends are Algolia, this company provides a search as a service platform with the semantic search capabilities enabling business to deliver more relevant uh, search results. Another startup is a Lucidverse. This startup offers a search platforms that uh, uses machine learning and NLP to search relevance and personalization. Number nine and last research trend of this video is a reinforcement learning. Currently, NLP-based solutions struggle when dealing with situations outside of their boundaries. Therefore, AI models need to be retrained for each specific situation that it is unable to solve, uh, which is highly time-consuming. Reinforcement learning enables NLP models to learn behavior that maximizes the possibility of a positive outcome through feedback from the environment. 
This enables developers and businesses to continuously improve their NLP models performance through sequence of reward-based training iterations. Such learning models thus improve NLP-based applications such as the healthcare and translation software, chat boards, and more. The examples of reinforcement learning are OpenAI. In addition to its work on language models, OpenAI is also exploring reinforcement learning for natural language tasks such as language generation and translation. The DeepMind is also an example of uh, reinforcement learning. This research organization is known for its work on reinforcement learning in general, including applications to natural language tasks. Friends, Spanish startup Igloo creates an explainable AI solution that transforms complex AI models into easy to understand natural language rule set. The startup applies AI techniques based on proprietary algorithms and reinforcement learning to receive feedback from the front wave and optimize NLP techniques. A group solution finds applications in customer lifetime value optimization, digital marketing, and customer segmentation, among others. So friends, these research areas and startups are really very much beneficial for the all researchers and for those who are willing to make their own startups. By staying abreast of these NLP research trends, you can leverage technology-based solutions to enhance your business processes and improve customer experiences. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to Learning Digitally for more updates on technology-based solutions. I believe this video may be beneficial for students of MS or MPhil or PhD or even uh, for those who are working on the different research domains. So NLP is a definitely fascinating research domain. You may choose NLP to solve the real world problems of the world. Take care, stay blessed.